The member for Cowan. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question is to the Prime Minister. The Prime Minister has claimed today's changes to Section 18C of the Racial Discrimination Act are about increasing freedom of speech. What forms of racial speech does the Prime Minister want people to be able to say that they cannot say right now? The Prime Minister has the call. Well, I thank, I thank the honourable member for a question. And the, the question really is this. What is the what is, what is Members on my the left. speech? What is the speech that the Labor Party say would not be prohibited under the revised wording? What is it? Really, what is it? The terms of harass and intimidate are clear terms, clear English terms. Clear, perfectly plain what they mean to be found in many statutes. The reality is that the language insult, offend or humiliate, she has been criticised by one expert after another and indeed, and indeed the, High Court, the High Court itself has been obliged to say to define it as involving serious effects not to be likened to mere slights. That is Justice Susan Kiefel, now our Chief Justice. Now, Mr Speaker, it is Members plain that a, law, a statute should speak in language that is clear and accurate. And what we need, what we have there, is a statute whose language creates a pall of insecurity over writers, over students, over cartoonists, because people look at those words and they say, so that means every, any insult, any offence, any humiliation, any hurt feelings is prohibited. And it's not an academic point. We've seen it with the University for Griffith is warned. We've seen it with Bill Lee. So a clear statute, clear language provides better protection and provides the protection both for Australians against racial vilification but also the protection of free speech. Australians are entitled to speak freely. It is one of our fundamental rights and we are striking the balance at the right point, the right point between protection against racial vilification and protecting free speech. We've got the balance right. Labor's lost the plot on this and on so many other issues. Has the Prime Minister concluded his answer? The member for Parks. 